Welcome to the Roger Smith Hotel. Are you checking in? Yes. The name's Wilson. How many nights will you be staying with us? Just the one. Hi there. You want a cherry? you'll find your stay comfortable. You'll be staying in room 1011. If you need anything, my name's Craig. Please call me at any time. You hurry up, we're gonna be late. What do I have to do to get you out of here on time? It is always your fault. <sighs> Unbelievable. Teddy, Mr. Thatcher called from school. He said that your scores have gone down this term. While we're gone, I want you to do all of your homework, okay? <sighs> Thank you. Come on, please, we're gonna be late. Unbelievable. All right, Teddy. Be good. Don't uh, get in any trouble. Do not leave the hotel room. Agent attributed inaccurately to Michael and Body. Favorite talks a good game. Oh, Angela ate the fly. <laughs> I'm the counterpane fairy. I don't know what that is. It's the sort of fairy that lives in hotels and watches out for children. I used to be one of those restaurant fairies, but I grew tired of it. There's nothing in it, you know? Do you like little boys? Yes, as long as they don't wander. But I was bored. You should be careful where you wander. Maybe you would like me to show you a story. Do you mean tell me a story? No, I mean show you a story. It's a little game I invented. You're gonna help me? To make reality of imagination, this is Bendix, the Tomorrow People. What is the magic that makes one's eyes sparkle and gleam, light up the sky? The name of the game is Lightworks. Choose any one of these squares and I'll show you how to play. That's all you have to do. Choose a square. Sparkle and gleam, light up the skies. The name of the game is Lightworks. How do you show those teasing lips so oh, they dazzle and shine as heart dust flips? The name of the game is Lightworks. Lightworks. 
Princess who lies waiting for me to rescue her? <laughs> Go through the Herald Door. Yes, Herald Door. What's so fit as an Herald Door for a hero of such great deeds? Great hero, 
wiser than before. Try the red door. Yes, the red door. Try the ruby door, kid. Then you'll never have to search for the princess again. No, I will not go to the ruby door. Twice you have tried to send me back to the garden, and you will fool me no more. Wait a minute. Fool on this. Now. In the enchantment. And now you'll be king of the Golden Kingdom and reign with me forever. Oh, wait, no. I, I can't stay here forever. I, I've got to go back home. But this is your kingdom now, and I'm your queen. Kids can be kings. the story of the yellow square. Did you like it? Wasn't it beautiful? Wasn't the princess lovely? Well, I must be journeying on. No, no, you can't go. Yes, I must go. I hear your mother coming. Will you come back again? We have to talk about Teddy. He has been saying some very strange things. Like what? He said that he met a fairy and that that fairy showed him stories. Okay? Do you know anything about this? I mean, the kid has got a healthy imagination. He talks about it in pure fact. This is not a fantasy. This is real. I, for one, think it's ridiculous. Don't you think you're being a little harsh? This is all your fault. You have to talk to him, get his feet back on the ground. Enough nonsense. I don't believe any of it. Did you put him up to this? I don't appreciate your tone. Excuse me? That's what Excuse I said. Excuse me? Hey, kid. Want a cherry? There you are, Teddy. We have to leave right now if we're going to be in time for dinner. Thank you so much. We had a lovely time staying here. I'm going to well. recommend it to all my friends. Teddy, here's my bag. Get the elevator. Thank you for staying with us. I look forward to your next visit. Mm -hmm.